But first, the man and woman accused of killing a guy and then stuffing his body inside the trunk of a car will stay in jail. And new tonight, we're learning more about the relationship between the three of them and how detectives track this case. Good evening to you, I'm Eric Von Aiken. Thanks for staying up late with us tonight. A judge told LaShawn Triplett and Johnny Wesley that they will stay in jail until trial. The two are accused of shooting and dumping Melvin Wilcox's body in his trunk and then leaving the car in an Orange County pharmacy parking lot. Tonight, News 6's Jerry Askin is talking to the victim's family about this gruesome crime. The two suspects appeared before a judge here Sunday at the Orange County Jail. They're both charged with first degree murder after investigators say they killed the victim inside of a home and left his body in the trunk of his own car. Why, why, why would they take his life? Why would they do it? 39 year old Melvin Wilcox's family is hurting. His aunt told me he was a working father who loved his two kids and would do anything for anyone. And that's why she's left with so many questions. Why did they do it to him? Because he's not a bad person. He don't bother nobody. So I've been trying to figure out why. Detectives say they found Wilcox dead in his own trunk in this Pine Hills pharmacy parking lot Friday. And that an autopsy confirmed he was shot three times, including once in his head. Detectives have arrested his child's mother, LaShawn Triplett and Johnny Wesley, charging them both with first degree murder in connection to his death. Not entitled to a bond. I'm praying that they don't let him go. Investigators first got involved when they say Wilcox's mom reported him missing last Wednesday and his car stolen. They said several hours of video surveillance from an undisclosed source shows the victim was likely killed inside of Wesley's home here on Elon Drive. Investigators said the video shows the victim arriving to and entering the home last Tuesday. His car is then moved to the front door of the house before it's later driven away. Now, days before, investigators say the victim ran into his child's mother with Wesley at the county fair and that he and Wesley got into it after finding out they had been dating. A search warrant finding evidence inside this home linking Wesley and Triplett to the crime, according to investigators, who say the couple then tried to clean the crime scene. I spoke with that victim's mother off camera. Right now she's asking for privacy, but she said her son leaves a 19 year old daughter and a 13 year old son behind. In Orange County, I'm Jerry Askin, getting results, News 6.